Hi, so today we have something really special and fun to talk about. Here, guys, we're looking at gold, 24 karat gold. Oh, it is, uh, is it ever so beautiful. Uh, carats are uh, an industry term for jewelry, uh, and uh, 24 karat being the term for pure gold. And you might also have heard of 14K, uh, uh, 18K. Uh, gold. Uh, so you would divide one by the other to know the purity of the gold. This being Luciteria science, we go straight for purity. And this is 99.95% pure gold. It's very close to a exactly pure, pure, pure as they come. Uh, and here we are looking at a cube that is one inch per side turned in, in exactly those dimensions to within 0 0.1 millimeters uh, of each dimension of pure gold. Uh, this worked out to be a little over $20,000. We actually lost money on the, uh, on the sale because between the time that the customer placed the order and the money uh, being deposited into our account and it went to the factory floor, the price had gone up substantially. Well, not substantially, but just enough that we lost a little money on it. But that's okay. Um, we very rarely uh, get to make these, so it's uh, a, a, a sort of a privilege for us to uh, get to handle these uh, beautiful things every once in a while. And uh, having an inch uh, of gold in every dimension in your hands is, is pretty impressive. It is so hefty. Uh, this weighs in at over 310 grams, um, which is close to the, very close to the theoretical density. Uh, it doesn't come quite to 100% because of small voids that get trapped inside uh, that lower the density and so um, I wanted to emphasize that uh, a lot, we get a lot of questions why is it that you know you your your gold cubes are so much more than bullion well the truth is that somebody's going to go out and say wow 19.7 uh, grams and a cubic centimeter so that works out to 20 times let's say uh, 50 uh, dollars a gram that should be a thousand dollars why are you charging fifteen hundred dollars for this well folks the truth is these don't just get poured in you don't take 20 grams of gold and pour it into a mold and out comes this beautiful thing uh, what happens is that the laboratory uh, has to buy to make a cube of uh, gold this size probably 30% more gold to start uh, and that's because the cube is starts out oversized and then uh, they use a machine called an EDM uh, which is actually electrically applied stylus through oil and every time the stylus touches the the metal uh, a little arc comes across between the stylus and the cube and that spark actually blows a, well, uh, a little bit away of the metal and it does that thousands of times a second until exactly the shape that you want is reached. But that's not the end. After that, the, the, the cube in its semi-finished form still has to go over to uh, a team that does polishing and you know it spends a long time in getting that polishing to look mirrored on every surface and look beautiful so these take uh, many hours to complete from the time that it starts out as you know just raw bars of gold and finished into this so the last the last piece is where, where it's laser engraved and uh, then it's sent on to us uh, for these big cubes, we make absolutely no profit at all. We shoot for a break even. It's okay because this is a very minor part of our business and it's a special treat to get to see these. So um, it's, it's okay if we don't make a little profit on this and we know people are very sensitive to the prices of um, precious metals. On here, 
the profit as minimal. Uh, usually we'll, we'll look at, I really don't know, but less than $50 of this is actually uh, profit, so to speak. You know, the rest is just uh, used up in, in, in what it costs from the factory, the shipping, the, uh, the other overhead fees. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's uh, a little demo of what the gold mirror cubes that we sell at Luciteria look like. I'd love it if you have any questions or concerns or want to talk more about this, uh, please leave a comment and I'll see to it that I answer those questions to the best of my ability. For now, this is Raciel at Luciteria. Thank you so much.